Hey guys! Hey. So welcome back to another video. Yes. We are the Chocolate Dogs. Yes. You know I have to ask, have you looked in the mirror today and told yourself that you're beautiful, that you're worthy, that you're competent, that you can do this? If not, stop this video, go ahead and do that, and then come right back and we can get started. Yes. So in this video, we're going to talk to you guys about time management, yes. um, five things that you can do to make sure that you're more efficient when you're studying. Mm -hmm. And hopefully you guys can like apply this to your life. Every day life. And tell us like how you, you know, if it's been working for you, if yeah. not, like what things that you have found helpful and things that you do, leave, leave in the description, not the description box, the comments below. Yes. Let us know what works for you. And maybe it could help somebody else, so. You never know. Yeah. But yeah, this is like, everybody ask us. Yeah. <laughs> how are you successful in med school? <laughs> time management. Use your time effectively. Manage your time. <laughs> it's all about time. Yeah, pretty much. It really is. So first things first. Numero uno. Make a schedule. Make a schedule. Make it realistic. And stick to it. <laughs> yes, make a schedule and stick to it. Yeah. You can write it down. You can have it online. You can have like an online calendar. Mm -hmm. You can have a planner, like whatever you, whatever works best for you and like how you make a schedule. Didn't do that, but definitely make a schedule. Put it up on your wall in your room. <laughs> like put it on your phone, whatever yes. you need to do. Make yes. a schedule. Two, make sure you're setting time limits whenever yes. you're doing your work. Mm -hmm. So that means Scheduling that you're going to be productive for like an hour and a half mm -hmm. and then scheduling in a 15 minute break We always have a timer of like, oh, I'm gonna do this. I don't know. I'm gonna tell you GI for like an hour and a half and then you gotta just like forget the break time yeah. Or you <laughs> so, like linger on a set of questions that you set aside an hour for but now mm -hmm. you've been doing them for two hours mm -hmm. now we need to we need to yeah. move on <laughs> yeah. you have to be very And it's hard. Yeah. It's hard. Be strict with yourself because yeah. the time like like she said you spend it when you get frustrated on a topic and you want to really get to like get through it yeah. you will spend three hours or something that you're supposed to only spend an hour and 15 mm -hmm. minutes on and then the rest of your to-do list is like yeah <laughs> it's gonna basically gonna be just tossed to the wayside because you yeah. were frustrated about one specific thing time yourself when you do questions too so do a question set for an hour and then have an, and then take a break yeah and then like have another hour to review that and then move on like yeah. setting time limits is very essential and like how you're gonna really manage your time well and then there's also apps i use like mm. this is not sponsored <laughs> but i mean if you want to <laughs> come on <laughs> i use a flora app f-l-o-r-a mm -hmm. and basically like I set a time so if I want to study for 50 minutes I set that time and then afterwards it like grows a plant and mm -hmm. like I can like send a plant to like somewhere that they need plants I don't know but you can like <laughs> pay to do that but it's a free app but if you wanted to pay for all the extra stuff then you can mm -hmm. but like I get a free treat after like you know I've studied for 50 minutes and then you can set a break time as well so if I study for 50 minutes I can set a break time for like 20 minutes or 15 minutes or mm -hmm. 10 minutes whatever so there's many apps that like will help you set productive. like time limits and stuff and be productive yeah. um, so number three make sure you're limited distractions yes turn your phone off, turn your phone off. <laughs> like it's very simple turn your phone actually off. and it's hard because literally i turn my phone back on I'm yes like, yes or like put your eye during step i will literally leave my phone in the car yeah so that like I, that was like the most productive i've ever been because i left my phone in the car and then i had gotten good of just like not going to my phone mm -hmm. so when i did have my phone after i had left it in the car for a few weeks like yeah. i didn't even miss it yeah but definitely like keep the phone as far away as you need to mm -hmm. um try to study in a place if you work in places that are more quiet then definitely like if you work best in places that are quiet then go to somewhere that's quiet yeah. <laughs> like don't, don't try to go to starbucks or... yeah don't try to go to starbucks <laughs> yeah Mich like, like maybe having conversations over there like it's not a, a yes. study spot to me yeah. it's really a place where you can review or like talk yeah. with your friends or whatever it's not but really to get like one. really good studying in no. for me honestly i can't study in like a coffee yeah, shop really or somewhere where there's like a lot of chatter i need something that's like Cool. very quiet mm -hmm. very just like me and my space mm -hmm. um so or yeah. if you do like people and you want to stay in our books but you kind of want a little bit of quiet you can have a little bit of both if you have like an airplane mode yeah and it has certain sounds you can listen to yeah. um instrumentals on youtube they probably have that mm -hmm. too that works for you that works for you or the noise um, canceling headphones noise canceling headphones like it's options for those mm -hmm. of you who do like to be around people because yeah. you get kind of like lonely studying by yourself. Yeah, that's real. Um, so yeah, especially during stuff studying, girl. Mm. <laughs> so limit distractions. Yeah, turn off your phone. Four, make sure you're doing your harder tasks first. First, when you have the most, energy. Have the most energy, because 
I found myself like I think the most like we both said the most serious we've ever been setting in steps. So that's what I'm always like, referencing back to. Yeah. Um, I think that in the early morning when I first like have my cup, first cup of coffee, I would do like a euro set because mm -hmm. those are the most challenging things for me to do. And that's when I was when I was reviewing, I had more energy to actually remember like what I was actually gonna be able to retain. Mm -hmm. And then when I had like less energy, I would do like Anki because it was a little bit more passive and it didn't really require that much like effort out of me. Yeah. And so. even now I do that. So like when I have like off days or like when I didn't have to be in the hospital as long, mm -hmm. like I'll do my questions first and then I'll say like my reviewing, like my Anki towards the end because I know like I barely have any energy. Yeah. So I definitely like now gear my studying towards what do you have the most time to do right. and what's the most important. Like what right. do you have to get done today? Right. Do those things. Because yeah. sometimes you can't do it all. Like even if you make a realistic schedule, sometimes you just can't do it all. Yeah. But make sure you do the things that are most important that you do that day. Yeah. So if you're taking physics, if you're taking chemistry, you're taking biochem, like certain there's certain things that you know it's gonna be, oh my gosh, I'm dreading this thing. Yeah. The thing that you dread the most, do that first and get it out of the way. So you don't have to worry about it no more and for the rest of the day. It's yeah. Done. It's for sure. And then number five, the be organized, y'all. <laughs> like your study space. Yeah your your to-do list like make sure everything is like organized so that you are able to easily follow it and like you're not easily distracted by things around you yeah it does make it easier because i'm not organized i'm not the most organized person <laughs> i am not <laughs> i'm not i mean yeah. i i i'm organized with my schoolwork but everything else in my life is yeah, well. not organized <laughs> well my school stuff is yeah. organized but yeah. everything else is not organized but when like i've noticed that like when my spaces are more organized i'm more feel, productive yeah. like i just feel better mm -hmm. i mean i can work in clutter but <laughs> i work better when yeah. it's not cluttered yeah so like be organized with your schoolwork mm -hmm. with like you know everything academic but also like in your life yeah try to be organized as well and that will help you be um a lot more productive and use your time well because you don't have to worry about using time to clean and like mm -hmm. do these other things because you're already working at this. Yeah, and try not to multitask either, y'all. Like, one thing I really focus on on like one thing. You can't be watching Netflix and doing Anki. It just yeah. doesn't work because you're not really focused on the car that you're looking at. You're really like trying to like watch the movie at the same time yeah. as like doing work. It's you know that your attention and all that stuff is is divvied up to different yeah. places and you're not really like giving your schoolwork or whatever at the appropriate time that it needs to be given. So yeah. and you're not yeah. learning the concept the way you should. You should and you not. don't want to have to go over something <laughs> twice just because you or three times. The first time. <laughs> so yeah, just be real with yourself. Yeah. Really focus on one thing at a time um, and be organized with your study space. That wraps up the video, but of course we have a gem for you guys. <laughs> um, so this video, I'm, I'm this gem I think goes to our pre-med students in our in our mess in our mess students. Yeah. Um, I think that with this whole time management video, it's very important to try not to be perfect. Um, <laughs> it is so 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 important, and it's very hard to do because we are perfectionists. We are type A people, and we're so adamant about like. Getting everything done at the same time, time. But it, and we don't extend ourselves grace. Like yeah. your to-do list cannot have twenty-five things on there. You can't. Cause it's not done. <laughs> done. And you're gonna feel like crap afterwards. <laughs> yeah, but it's not your fault. You can't do everything. But you think you can do everything, but you can't. You're not so. Like, you're not Superman. You're not perfect. <laughs> like you're not you just, <laughs> Like you really have to be realistic. And I know people. And are inachievable. Like people are just like, oh, well, you know, you gotta reach for the stars and like no honestly on a day-to-day -day basis bro <laughs> like let's keep it 100 on a day-to-day -day basis make sure that what the goal that you're setting is like realistic because then you're gonna feel like every time you go back and you lay in the bed and now you're like damn i didn't do nothing i didn't do nothing today i didn't accomplish any of my goals and then you're gonna feel defeated this um, stuff really matters during third year because yeah. you don't have as much time so actually going through this stuff i'm like mm, i'm gonna do this because <laughs> my toxic trait is that i'll be productive one day but the next day yeah. yes like, well, you know, I did a lot yesterday, so. <laughs> like, it's really bad. So, um, yeah. hopefully you guys just are able to find some encouragement and be consistent yes. during 2020. So, if you guys can tell, we have some fabulous girls that we've been donning in this video. They are from Sikora, Z-I-K-O-R-A. Mm -hmm. um, Shout out to you for sending them to yes, us. They're really nice. They're really nice. They, they came packaged well, mm -hmm. nice and pressed. If you guys are interested in getting a pair, then of course, we will leave the description or like the link in the description box mm -hmm. and you guys can get get one. Yeah. They um, have a lot of different options and like styles to choose from. So yeah. Yeah. check our girl out. For sure. Um, so make sure you guys are like, are like comment and subscribe to our yes. channel. Share um, with a friend or, or two, two or five. Or five or two. Um, make sure you're following us on Twitter, chocolate underscore docs, mm -hmm. Instagram and Facebook at the chocolate docs. 
Um, we're gonna be posting a little bit more. You know, you guys, we've just been, 30 years just been a lot. So we wanna focus on rotations, but we also wanna give you guys content. So a little bit of balance. Um, we're gonna try our best in 2020. <laughs> We're gonna try our best, you know, to give you guys as much content as we possibly can. Yeah. So just bear with us, be patient, give us grace. So yeah, we will see you in our next video. Bye. Bye.